I don't know exactly what happened, guys. But Saffron's gone. He'd been doing differently for a while, and I thought it was just because it took so much effort for him to get growing the way the rest of them were. I mean, he was small, and he always had some issues. But I didn't expect this. I thought he was sleeping extra because he, when they sleep, they grow a lot of the time. And he started off with a rough start. He never had the same skull shape as the others. But he had a lot going for him. He was just a really cool little bird. While the others would be rambunctious and raucous, he would just... He would look off like he knew something that everybody else didn't. So, yesterday he had trouble with the heat and he got better. And today, I didn't, I don't know what happened last night, but everybody was fine. There were no disturbances at our, our tent. I had to work on stuff last night. I didn't have a choice. Sometimes you have to when things are the way they are. But I made sure everybody was secure and cozy and Izzy was in her nest and the little ones were in their playpen. And when everybody got up this morning, Saffron was moving a lot slower and... I had found some, some grow gel in the car when I was working on stuff last night. And I gave it to him because that usually brings chicks back. It didn't with Amadeus, but it, it always has before. And Amadeus was acting different than any other bird. And now that I think about it, so was Saffron in his way. But anyway. He got worse. And then he started having like a little bit of paralysis on the side. And then he had a seizure, and he was he was back a little bit, and then he was gone. So after the rain stopped, I came out, and I honored him the best way I know how. <laughs> and just think about what we our plans are, and this, that, and the other, and how maybe none of it is really that important. I had plans to go off today and get some stuff done, and now I just really don't want to, and I'm not going to. I'm just going to spend the rest of the day with my birds. God bless and keep you, everybody.